we have a warning for you. If you have little ones in the room, you may want to ask them to leave. There is an unbelievable injustice happening worldwide. Modern day slavery involving the sex trade or forced labor. The system is vast, it is corrupt. Children as young as three years old. The number of innocent victims involved is absolutely terrifying. But right now, Hollywood's shocking new sex trade documentary and the celebrity outrage today. It is a gritty documentary that takes us inside the dark world of child prostitution. Call and response. I saw this documentary the other night, mm -hmm. and it's very, very moving. Mm -hmm. Musician and first-time filmmaker Justin Dillon documented the alleged abuses happening around the world. I know you were expecting a problem when you went in, but you had to be stuck at what you saw. Absolutely. I think the most stunning piece of it is that it's happening in our financial districts. It's not just out in the rural areas or outside of uh, our own lives. It's right in the center of, of what's happening here in our lives. Trafficking of people is the fastest growing crime on the planet. Slave traders made $32 billion just last year. More money than the profits of Google, Nike, and Starbucks combined. Rarely have we seen stars taking such a strong stand. Women are, are taken and um, gang raped into submission. They live under constant threat of violence. I went to Mumbai and I met uh, these girls who were rescued from brothels. Along with former U.S. Secretary of State Madeleine Albright and New York Times columnist Nicholas Kristof. This is one of those rare issues okay. where left and right truly agree. Justin Dillon also is encouraged that a growing 21st century abolitionist movement featured on the film's website will inspire others to act. Whether it's giving, whether it's being involved in our slave-free initiative, people can actually make a difference. Kareen Winter, CNN, Hollywood.